All right, you've been procrastinating long enough. It's the end of the year. It's time to do some tax planning. And I'm going to recommend my friend Marcus Warren of Warren Wealth Management because my man Marcus knows taxes. He knows retirement because right. he is all of the above. And, I, you know, I kid about that. I say all of the above, but you really are because there's some who specialize in taxes and there's others who specialize in wealth management. Right. But you do both and you've earned it. Yeah, you know, that's that's uh, really what, what sets us apart, um, you know, simply because, yes, we do do the investment management side of it, the financial or retirement planning side of it, uh, but then we also do the uh, tax planning side, which, you know, really, it seems like it, uh, you know, should kind of go hand in hand, but, you know, for years and years, um, you know, if you go talk to your investment advisor and ask about taxes, they're going to push you off, and vice versa, if you talk to your accountant about investments, they're going to push you off uh, and redirect you, so um, we decided to bring it all in-house. So the right direction is to my left. That's what you're saying. That's it, right? <laughs> <laughs> I do believe that. Okay, tax tips. So, folks, uh, hopefully you are at tax planning, and you probably are, but if not, I, I think you probably have a lot of your friends who come to you and go, okay, Marcus, I know you know this arena. Help me out. Are there any tips that you can give us as we get close to the end of the year? Yeah, there, 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 there are a few tips, and, and it's interesting because, you know, we deal with uh, mainly uh, people who are in retirement, and, you know, re retirement, uh, a lot of people have been told that you're going to be in a lower tax tax bracket, you're going to pay less taxes, and really that's not the case for a number of, for a number of different reasons. Number one is um, just in retirement, you lose a lot of the deductions you had while you were working, and then, you know, the whole concept and myth about you're going to want less income in retirement, and what we have found out is that that's not what retirees want. They want to retire, and they want to have just as much income uh, that they had while they were working so they can enjoy their retirement, and so for those reasons, a lot of them find that themselves in these higher tax brackets and so there are a, a few different uh, tips um, that people can employ especially as we get closer to the end of the year uh, here we are um, it's tax planning season we're meeting with a lot of clients in our office now because uh, in order to do true tax planning you have to be proactive and do it before the end of the year so um, what are a few things that people can look to do? Uh, number one is you can do what's called um, tax loss uh, harvesting. And that's basically when you look at your uh, investment gains and you look at your investment losses and you try to offset those. So you have capital gains, you have your capital losses, and you can minimize taxes uh, that way. A matter of fact, if you uh, haven't had that great of a year and you have more losses uh, than, than you do gains, then you can actually take uh, up to $3,000 of those losses and you can offset that with your um, uh, regular income. So uh, that's, a, that's one tip that, that, that people can use now. Um, one of the things that uh, we're doing a lot in our office, uh, or the second tip, was, would be to look at Roth conversion. Um, and that's basically taking money from your tax-deferred bucket or those tax-deferred accounts, your 401Ks, your IRAs, company retirement plans, uh, and uh, basically converting those into your Roth IRAs, right? Now, the one thing you can't get away from is paying the tax. Once you do that, uh, there is a tax, it is a taxable event. However, Right now, we are in the lowest tax rate environment that we've had in uh, over a generation, and uh, we expect taxes to be a lot higher in the future than they are now. So a lot of times it makes sense uh, to pay the lower tax now, position your money over into uh, those Roth IRAs or uh, life insurance retirement plans, these tax-free uh, vehicles, and then if taxes go up 20%, if taxes go up 50%, if they double, if they triple, whatever it may be, it doesn't matter because you've already already pay taxes at that low rate by doing that Roth conversion. So there are a number of different things that, that people can do uh, to save money for retirement and actually to save money in taxes now before the end of the year. As you probably discerned, this man really knows his business. Let's talk a little bit about the reason to, to call Warren Wealth Management because everyone has, well, you talk a lot about buckets and everyone has different buckets yes. or you know maybe you have Roths or you mentioned 401ks, IRAs, yep. that kind of thing. So you can look at someone and have strategies to keep more money in their pocket. 
did. You you mentioned a few of them there, but yeah. essentially that's a good reason to meet with you one on one because everyone's situation is just not the same. Right. It, it it's not. But uh, the commonality that that most retirees have is the fact that we've been told to defer, 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 defer taxes, defer taxes while you're working and just pay them later. Unfortunately, um, what happens is you are deferring taxes on the seed or the acorn, right? And eventually you're going to have to pay taxes on the harvest or that oak tree. And most people are in that situation where they have most of the money saved in those tax deferred accounts. We call that the ticking tax time bomb. And so, you know, a lot of times, you know, people are surprised that, hey, I'm paying more in taxes than I thought I would. And that's simply because of what we've, you know, been told. And we always try to break that old paradigm and say, okay, we understand where you are. But there are strategies that you can implement now to put you in a better position moving forward. Yeah, and, and one thing that's great about meeting with you is the fact that you talked about tax planning, that you always got to be proactive and look ahead. Yes. And, and you see on the horizon there are some changes in the tax situation for everyone, mm -hmm. and you can get ahead of that so you can minimize the, um, what is the damage, I guess, is the best yeah. way to put it. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, it, it's, it's like this. So, um, you know, there's a lot of uh, um, financial advisors or brokers who... Uh, their main job, uh, an advisor or a, a broker's main job is to accumulate assets, right? But um, there's a lot of uh, financial advisors out there right now uh, dangling what I call tax bait. Uh, they're using tax bait marketing. Uh, to get clients in the door when they really don't know too much about taxes. So the uh, average retiree has to be aware of that. And then, of course, you do have your, your CPAs and your accountants. However, you know, CPAs, they account for what's already happened, right? You basically give them, let, let them know the income you made, your uh, deductions, and they basically record history and then let you know how much you owe Uncle Sam uh, during that tax they season. They don't play. Right? They, they're, 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 they're basically not proactive they're reactive yeah. in our office we're, we're we're different just like I was saying earlier uh, we're not only investment managers and financial planners but we're also uh, tax enrolled agents what does that mean an, an enrolled agent is basically a uh, the highest designation given by the IRS um, um, uh, empowered by, we're empowered by the United States Treasury to represent clients uh, if they have any tax issues, things of that nature. And then we're also tax strategists where we know tax code, tax law, tax theory. So we're able to help clients navigate that tax code and put more money in their pocket. And so uh, in our office at Warren Wealth, uh, the left hand knows what the right hand's doing. Uh, there's no one trying to give you the bait and switch by saying, hey, we know about taxes and you come in and we don't really know anything. Or or we're, all, we're not reactive in the way that we tax plan, we're proactive. And so that's what sets us apart, and that's what helps out investors and retirees long term. If you would like access to this wealth of information, and you can tell, as I said, he knows his business, then you need to give him a call. In fact, 15 minute conversation with our final 30 seconds. If they want to have a quick conversation with you and, and gain some of this knowledge, how do they do that? Yeah, they can go to talktomarcus.com. You can also go to warrenwealth.net. Schedule that 15 minute phone call. If you're close or you're in retirement, it is crucial figure out how you can save money on taxes today. All right. Coming up here, we've got uh, punched 